Welcome back, guys, for more Ostriv. What are we going to do in this episode? I've no idea. We're, we're just going to we're just going to grow and get bigger. That is the plan. So, um, okay, now this several I, well, I don't know. I, I think a few people commented that um, this field's not active. They're absolutely right. Um, you know what? Pause before we get into the new season. Um, the reason that I forgot about that is because I didn't forget about that. I actually activated that field about four or five times. Uh, but every time that I did remember to do it, the game crashed. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah. So, but I've remembered it now. That's the important thing. So, we've got the, those fields active. Um, what else? Now, we're growing hemp. And I've got to say, hemp, I don't think hemp is particularly useful. Because from, from my researching, I don't think we can sell clothes or hemp. And I think we've got a fair amount of it now. And we've got 21... What about if we go over here to the farm? Um, yeah, we've got like 21.5 hemp, and it's like, yeah, well, what are we going to do with it? So I think I'm going to take hemp out of the rotation. So I'm going to get rid of hemp. Get uh, Right click to remove. Yeah. Oh, I can't get rid of it. Can I change it? If I say fallow. Yeah, yeah, I can. And then... Um... So if I change that to right click to remove, why can't I remove it? Now I only, I mean I, it does mean that I only need two fields for the for the sunflowers, but I kind of want another one. Um, let's just get rid of that. Let's do it like that. So that'll lie fallow this year. Okay, fine. Right. So um, that's sorted my fields out for this year. And um, but, but, but what else did I want to do? There was one other thing that I wanted to do, and I can't remember what it was. I want to move the forestry. Um, we can let this. We can let this go. Right. Um, cash. I'm. I'm not going to play around with these settings at the moment. I'm just going to kind of leave things as they are because we're we're actually like okay at the moment. We. I mean, we were down like 250 last year, but that's because I sent a messenger and we spent like 190 on buying stuff. So that's like 220. So we're only down like like around 40. And we've got our sunflower oil to sell and stuff like that. So um, I'm going to go over here. I'm going to bump this up because we've already got 20 sunflower oil in here. So I'm going to bump it up to I'm going to bump it up to like 50. Let's make sure all of our sunflower oil gets put in there. Um, I do want to extend out and get another farm going. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna lay, uh, first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get some houses building. So, build that one. Yeah, build that one. Build that one. In fact, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna unpause these, I think. Yeah, build all of these houses. Uh, whoops. If you can, before I ask you to do other stuff. And you can change it, you can move this stuff around. Somebody, somebody left a comment about that. It's like, yeah, I did know. I mean, <laughs> I just hadn't had need to. Right, uh, boom, 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 boom. What, uh, well, oh yeah, yeah, I was going to put some more fields in. Let's put some more fields in. So, I think we'll have another, we'll extend this out and we'll have another farm along here and then we can extend these hay dryers along, along here. Which I think is kind of a nice, I like how that looks, this whole thing. So, that's what we're going to do. Where are we? And I need to, oh, that was the other thing. I need to buy a bull. I need to buy a bull. Um, hopefully a messenger will turn up, but if they don't, I'll send a messenger out, because it only costs 30, so it's not like a big deal. Um, what was I doing? Uh, yeah, fields. Let's do, so, boom, boom, and now, where, I want my field facing the other way, damn it. So I want it field facing over there, so, pop that in there. Now, you can you can move fields from one farm to another. So I'm building the fields on this farm, but then I'll transfer them. Now we want to see the ploughing. The the cliffhanger at the last of the uh, end of the last episode was um, to see. Oh, there they go. Oh, oh, here she goes. And look at that. And look, our cows have been let out into a fallow field. Awesome sauce. And there they go. Whiz whiz whiz. It is pretty cool, isn't it? And then they take the plough back. They'll take a break. And then probably somebody else will come along. Somebody else going to come and grab the plough? Come on, guys. It's ploughing season. Do the ploughing. 
<laughs> Come on, somebody. Oh, there we go, eventually. And they're going to go and plow this field over here. And it looks so much better when they're plowing the fields and they turn brown. Like the farms like really start to look like farms. That is pretty awesome. Right, well, we've got houses going up. We've got one going on there, one going on there. Good job, boys. Build, build, build. Um, now, I was, I was thinking, like, where can I get a bit of extra labour from? But to be honest, I don't really know where I could steal any labour from. We've only got one person in the, in the granary. We've got a couple in the cow shed. But these are women anyway, so they wouldn't help us with our construction. So really, it's just about getting like more people. We've got 37 people in the village. We need to crank that up. We've only got like 12 men and 12 women to work. So yeah, I think right now it's all about building houses and expanding. All right, well, while we're waiting for those houses to get built, we can lay this stuff out. So what do I want? I want a field. And now this is where I'm gonna find out like how well, oh, see, this is why I was taking time to get these like lined up properly. It's kind of important. So that should be at this end. So flip, flip. We want that at that end. And I know the maximum output's 21. As long as it's around 20, 19, 20, 21, that kind of level is fine. Um, let's get another field going. Do, 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 field. Now I do want my farms to be like a bit different and whatever, but this layout for these two farms, I think is kind of nice. Oh, messenger from Balaclear, excellent. Let's get that in. Right, messenger from Balaclear. I want you to sell me, um, what do I want? I want a bull, don't I? Yes, not six, I just want one. I only need one, deal. Boom, send me that. Do I need anything else? Do I want to sell them any potatoes? How many potatoes have we got? Uh, potatoes, we've got 14. I mean, I could sell some potatoes, but I'm not gonna. I want to build a food supplies a little bit. So I've got a bull. We've got a bulk on the way. Almost here. Oh, the cows are like, hey, hey girls. There's a, there's a boy coming to town. <laughs> They'll be very happy. And as soon as we get that bull in there, then we'll, uh, we should start breeding. Come on, where's our bull? That guy should have got here by now. Did you see him? I didn't see him arrive. Oh, there we go, bull. Hooray. So, uh, and I'm fairly sure that there isn't a bull humping cows uh, um, animation. So, so if you were looking for that, sorry, sorry. It's just not gonna happen. I'm gonna bump up an extra worker because um, we've now got We've, we've got 10 of 20, and they're going to start breeding, so I want to make sure that we've got extra. We're getting uh, milk, we've got hay and water in the barn, ready for the winter. We're ploughed up, our crops are growing. We're building more houses. Oh. Come on, guys, get this stuff built. Man, they're being very slow with the building, but I think it's just, uh, I think it's just a labour shortage. But like, like seriously, where can I steal some labour from? Um, we have got plenty of wood. You know what? I might, I might fire those guys for a bit. Go, and, go and build something. So we've got a worker on that now. If I can bring, if I can get some houses built, bring some more people in, then I think things can happen like quite a lot faster. Certainly, what I'm hoping. But again, look. Nobody doing anything. Nobody doing anything. I think it's a pretty relaxed lifestyle in these Ukrainian villages, where they're like, yeah, should I go to work today? I don't know, maybe I'll just sit by the river. Watch the world go by. Or it could be something else. It could be, I don't know, like maybe I've got a lack of hand carts or something like that. Now, my carpenter, um, do I get my carpenter to, to start like making some stuff or do I get rid of him and get him to do some laboring? That might be an idea. I've, got, I've only got one cart park i'm i see i'm wondering should i have a car park over by the by the farm i'm thinking that might be a really good idea you know i'm gonna do that i'm gonna do that let's put in a car park so 
Um, let's flip this around. Which way do I want it? Oops. And that way. So, should I put a cart park in there? I think I'm going to. Yeah, boom. It insta build. And then I'm going to say, order me four carts. Maybe that'll help. Maybe that'll help. Oh, we've got, we've got some people just arrived to live in this house. So we're up to 42 people in the village. Sweet. So we're continuing to grow. That's good. How's our food situation? Food's looking okay. We've got some flour. We've got some potatoes. We've got, uh, we've got milk coming in now. We've got, uh, we're, we're down on fish. I could do with a bit of fish coming in. Uh, I'm gonna have a, I'm gonna have a guy in there. Now we've got some more people arrived. Um, let's, let's have a look. Have a look jobs wise. We've got we've got 32 open vacancies and 31 of them are for men. So man, we need a lot more people. Need a lot more people. My God. Right. So I've got um, those three fields in there. And then I had like the two there and the one there. So am I gonna? Have this pretty much like I had it over here. I think I probably am. I'm, pro I'm probably going to kind of just do a bit of a mirror image. Because I think it will actually kind of look good. Yeah. Yeah. That's what we'll do. Let's get um, let's get another farm going then. So what do I want? I want uh, production and I want a farm. So where's this farm going to go? This farm is going to go there. It's still going to be facing that way. So we just need to leave a bit of a gap between there. Fine. Okay. So, that's not quite straight, is it? Come on, flip around. Oh, man. Trying to, trying to get these things straight is, is a bit fiddly. Come on. Oh, man. Come on. Oh, there we go. That's, I think that's, that's pretty straight, isn't it? Yeah, it's pretty straight. So, I'm going to give myself a little bit more room on this one, I think. So, let's, let's put you there. So, bosh. We've got a farm. Hooray. And there was much rejoicing. So, we need to get that blooming thing built. But, but right now, it really, it's all about building houses. I mean, I want to get on and do other stuff, but we just need more people. Like, lots and lots more people. Where are we? So, how's our cash situation? Yeah, we're down at around 470. I'm not too worried about that. Have we got any, more, have we got any cows? Have we had any breeding going on? Oh, yes, we've got a newborn. We've got a newborn bull. Yeah. Now, <clears throat> the the bulls, obviously, don't produce uh, milk. Uh, they're only useful for either turning into oxen. Uh, and basically, like, what's the difference between an oxen and a bull? Uh, an oxen, they cut their balls off. I'm sorry to be so brutal, but <laughs> that's what they do. They, um, they whip their knackers off and um, then stick a yoke on them so that they... You know, Nice and passive, and then send them out to plow the fields. That's what they do. Or we can slaughter them and uh, turn them into uh, all beef patties for our for our for our McDonald's that we're going to set up. Oh yeah, because like once we've got beef, uh, we're all we've already got like potatoes for the fries. We've got the sunflower oil, so we can we can fry them, and then um, we've got the flour for the buns, and then so all we need is the beef, and then we can make our own McDonald's. Uh, we've got the milk. Oh, hang on. Did I, did I set this up to have milk? No. Um, you know what? Stop selling sunflower oil and start selling milk. There we go. Right, so now we can have thick shakes as well. Excellent. McDonald's coming to, coming to a, a Ukrainian village near you. <laughs> that would be so cool. Right. We got... Uh, they've got to do all these houses first. It's all about doing the houses. But they are, they are getting on with it. They're getting on with it. We're getting some labourers. Bring stuff around. Um, we've got our cart park. We've got two carts in there. We've got all... They, yeah, he's working on the last one now. Our carpenter. Excellent. It's rather good news. Um, I'm looking around. Like, is there anywhere else that I want to cart? I've got one near the forestry. I've got now got one over by the farm, which kind of covers this area. Uh, do we need another one anywhere? I don't think we really do at this point. I don't know. Like, maybe... Maybe one over here might be a good idea. Um, the other thing that would be useful somewhere over here would be a well. Because they've got to, like, like this house, they've got to go all the way up there to get their water and come back. Um, 
same with these people. They've got to walk all the way over there, or they've got to go all the way up there. So, I'm, yeah, I'm thinking a well somewhere in this area would be a good thing. Maybe in this spot. I don't know whether I can get a well and a cart park in. Let's have a look. So, well... Um, I mean, I could... I could potentially just plop the well in there. There's room to get around it. So... Yeah, I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna do that. Yeah, go on. We'll have a well there, and that leaves me room then to put in a cart park. Oh, yeah, no, doesn't fit. Oh, man. I was hoping that would fit in there. Um, I, now, now I could put one kind of over here. Uh, but it's uneven terrain. I could probably, I could probably like angle it round. Um, bum, 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 bum. Do, I, like, do I even want one over here? Yeah, I think I'm going to put one in over here. Like, what the hell? It's, not, it's certainly having one is not going to hurt. Let's have it round that way. I think. Uh, if if I can get it in though with the uneven terrain. Um, oh yeah, I can just. That'll do. Just there. Boom. And we'll order some more carts. Build some more carts for me. Right. How are we doing? Do we need more wood? Yeah, we do. Right, let's get those workers back on. Uh, do, 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 do. So I've got the well. We've got three more houses and a farm to get built. How are we doing? Cash is going down slowly, but we'll we'll sell some stuff soon. We've got, we're up to 52 people in the village. Woohoo! But look at the open vacancies. It's like 47 open vacancies. And we need more people. Uh, how are you doing? Yeah, you're working on building this. You're putting up the walls now. And then you've got to do the last bit and the last bit of thatching. Oh, they've started on this one now. Good. Getting the foundations in for that one. That one's underway. So, yeah, it's, it's all happening. We're getting there. Started on that one yet? Nah. They've got a lot to do before they get to that. All right, cool. Um, so that's going to bring us in like what else? That's going to bring us in like another three men and another three women. So yeah, but look, I mean, you know, forty open vacancies. That's a lot of open vacancies. Now I want to move the forestry back to there, but I kind of don't really want to do that at the moment because. Because we've got other stuff that needs to happen. And it's it's all about waiting for these blooming houses to get built. How are we doing for sunflower? Look, we're up to 30 sunflower. Sweet. We're into September. Everything's got done. Which is awesome. Yeah, everything's got done this year. Which is pretty peachy. Cool. Um, shall I do the, um, I do the extra fields? I've put that in, so yeah, I think I'll, I think I'll do. I think I'll lay out my extra fields. I mean, I've got, I've got nothing else to do, so I might as well, really. So let's see. That's there. Uh, I'm going to try and do this like that. So that looks pretty straight, doesn't it? Um, yeah, that's how far out we want to go. Come this way, touch, and. There, I think. Right now, we want to flip this around so the gate is there, facing the farm. So that's right. And then I'm going to stick to my kind of twenty size, I think. So bang that one in there, and get another one. Boom, boom, and flip it around that way. Uh, nope, that way. And maximum output twenty. Boom. We've got two more houses just got built. Nice. This is this is growing nicely. And we're going to have a bridge going across here. I can't wait to build the bridge, but I guess I'm going to have to wait to build the bridge because we've got other stuff that needs to get built first. Like, quite crucially. So, um, I've got three fields there. I've got two fields there. Now, i just got to decide where I'm going to put my other field. Now, obviously, on this side, I put it that way. But I am kind of thinking, like, maybe I'll put it that way. Um, hang on. No, I only need five fields, don't I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I've, I've got the wheat potato fallow rotation. And then I'm not growing hemp, so it's just sunflower fallow. So I only need five fields. 
Oh, that's nice. I could have a, you know what? I could have the farm there. I could have another farm here and, and repeat the pattern over here if I wanted to. That would be nice. Or I could put in an extra two fields and have uh, another sunflower rotation going on, which would also potentially work. Ooh, I like that idea as well. Right, now I'm going to I'm gonna do, am I going to do another cow shed? I'm probably going to do another cow shed over here as well. And, uh, and have like another well over here and then some more hay barracks. I like the idea of a row of hay barracks. Let's get some, should we get some more hay dryers along here? Um, boom, 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 boom. Uh, hay barracks are all full. So we've got like 60 hay and we've got hay on there. So um, maybe, I don't know, should I get another couple of hay barracks going? Yeah, go on. It doesn't hurt. It sure as hell doesn't hurt. So let's have one. We've got a messenger from Dahachi. So let's have that there, that there. Sweet. And they're coming in and they're bringing it all in. Excellent. So we got, we're not short of hay. That's not a problem. And we can have another six of those along there once I put the other stuff in. Oh, they're starting work on the farm. Woohoo! Hooray. And there was much rejoicing. All righty. Let's get rid of that. So we've got all of our houses built. Sweet. What are we up to? We're up to like 63 people now. But we still need like loads more. What, what the hell? That's saying 30, why is that saying 36 adults? Oh yeah, no, no, no that's right. I was, pff, I'm going mad. So we've got open job vacancies like four, eight, nine, eight. It's kind of bouncing around a little bit, but that's that's looking pretty good. Now we've got some extra people. I suppose um, we've only got one construction job going on, which is why. Uh, so why the, the open vacancies has gone down like a huge amount. So we can start doing some other stuff. I want to move this. So I'm going to get that done now. Uh, am I going to get that done now? Um, or do I want to get my extra cow shed and stuff like that going? I don't know. What are we up to? We're up to 14 animals now. Woohoo! We have got... We've got... Uh, bum, bum, bum. So what, we had 10. We've now got 14. So... We've got a two-month-old cow, a three-month-old bull, a four-month-old bull, and a five-month-old cow. So we've had we've had four babies. Woo! Good on you, Mr. Bull. He's he's been having a nice time. Well done. Alrighty. Um, shall I do? Shall I do my extra cow shed? I gotta say, I am kind of tempted. Now, now, good question. How, how where am I going to put my slaughterhouse? Now, that's a very good question. Let's see. Production slaughterhouse. How big is this building? Um, it's not massively huge. I mean, I guess I'd kind of like it in town. But I want my shoemaker in town as well. Um, I tell you what, it's a blooming shoe. I, I wonder if I could squeeze it in there. That would actually be a really good place to put it. If I rotate that just a fraction, that might just squeeze in if I rotate, rotate it the right way. Um, no, no, not that way. No that way will you fit in there oh you will ho, 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 ho. so shall we have that in? if I rotate that just a fraction more uh, and have it kind of there oh that's uneven terrain oh don't don't do that to me now that I found that I can fit it in don't do that to me oh no it's not it's not gonna go in oh that's like what about if I rotate it the other way I still don't think it'll go in. No, uneven terrain, uneven terrain, uneven terrain. No, it's not going to go in. Damn it. Okay, well, what about... Um, would it fit up here, maybe? Uneven terrain. Man, that's hard to place. Yeah, it doesn't want to go in anywhere there. Well, it's going to have to go somewhere. I mean, it could go. I mean, it could go down here, but that's like quite a long way away from the cows. I don't really want it that far away. Now, I suppose I could get rid of a field. Oops, I could get rid of a field. Pause. We're in December. I could get rid of a field here, um, which is maybe not the worst idea I've ever had. What's this? This is um. This is currently doing wheat and stuff. So, this is doing 
fallow uh, wheat and then potatoes. This is doing potatoes. Da, da, da. So, you know what? If I change this one, um, I want you to do. So, hang on. This is. Okay, come on. Uh, this is fallow and then wheat. So, uh, this is potato. So, this one should be wheat. So, if we make that wheat and then. Then it's potatoes, isn't it? It goes wheat, potato, fallow. Right. Yeah. And then this one is sunflower and fallow. So this one should be fallow and sunflower. Right. And then this one we can get rid of. <laughs> so deactivate it. Um, get rid of that stuff. Yeah. Demolish. Yeah. Let's get rid of that. So demolish. And it's gone. Hooray. So that gives us a whole area now that we can do all of this kind of stuff. Oh, that's that's worked out kind of. Oh yeah, carry on, carry on, carry on building. Um, is this farm going to be ready? There's plenty of people working on it. It's almost built. I wonder. You know, we we might be able to get this done. Right, that is done. Okay, I'm going to say. Let's see. So we've got five fields there, and we've got five new fields. So I want to say transfer that. So, that's no fields of science. Where are we? Um, is that is that go to or is that transfer? I, I've got to say I haven't transferred. Oh, assign other. Yeah, um, assign other. Click on the farm or cow shed to reassign. Boom. There we go. So, did I just reassign that one? I can't. I, I, I've got to follow this now. Yeah, no, I don't want that one. That's not the one I want. Assign to back to there. Right, let's try this. So we want to assign that one to here, that one assigned to here, that one assigned to here. There we go. There we go. Assign to there and that one assigned to there. Sweet. So we've now got all of those. So this, let's see. This one is going to be wheat. Oh, I need a manager, don't I? Yeah, yeah, manager. And it needs to be a female manager. Oh, see, it's a guy. I don't want a guy there. Come on, give me a female manager. Give me a female manager. Hiring options. Hire women as workers. Give me a manager. Oh, there we go. Hannah, perfect. So, pause. Let's get this set up. So, this is going to be wheat, at, well, wheat, potato, fallow. Then... Um, which which one is that? That's that one. So okay. So this one is going to be uh, potato and fallow and wheat, like that. And then this one is going to be fallow, wheat and yeah, wheat and potato. Boom. Then that is going to be sunflower and fallow. And this one is going to be fallow and sunflower. Boom, so we've got our new farm set up. We need to plow. Um, we'll get a couple of workers here, order a plow. Need two adult oxen. Now, the question is, are my, are my bulls old enough? Um, no, they're not gonna be old enough. You need adults. Uh, can I order? No, oh man. Oh well. So what I can say is I can I can say I want them to be oxen, but it won't allow me to to do it yet until they're older. Oh man! So I, I might just leave that then. It I mean we know that we can we can manage without ploughing the first year anyway. So it's not it's not like it's the end of the world. Okay. So now that we've got that set up, do I need anything else? Do I need anything else? Don't think so. Just the farm and the fields. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Alrighty, so we've got a second farm up and running. Sweet. We'll see how we do for labour, but we should be alright for labour. Um, yeah, we've got no open vacancies, actually. We've got, actually got excess people. I need to get some more construction going. Right, I want to move that. I want to get the slaughterhouse in it. Should we get the slaughterhouse going? Yeah, probably. Now, let's do the forestry first. Uh, no, let's not. Let's do the... No, no, let's do the slaughterhouse first. Yeah, let's do the slaughterhouse first. I'm all over the place, aren't I, this time? Um, we're, 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 we're slaughterhouse. So how big is this? It's that big. I think having the slaughterhouse right next to the farm is kind of a good thing. Let's flip you around. And have you kind of there-ish? Um, 
I, I think I'm going to put it kind of down here to create more of a more of a narrow road there. Boom, in it goes. I don't think that's particularly... You know, I'm going to do that again because that's not particularly well placed. Oh, no, they're already working on it. Now, yeah, just go ahead. That's not the end of the world. All right, so I've got my slaughterhouse going on there. I want to put in... Um, I want to put in a tannery. Now, the tannery I'll put in behind here. So let's get let's get a tannery going. Where's the tannery? Because tanneries are horrible places. They are stinky, really nasty, nasty places, tanneries. So I want to kind of put that away from town. I'm just wondering if I could put the... Can I squeeze the tannery next to that? That would be... That would kind of work. Oh, yeah. We have a little complex of buildings going on over here. That works nicely. All right, so let's put the tannery. Let's leave a little gap. I will put the tannery there. Cool. Now, that's going to produce us leather. Oh, we've got a family that's out of money. Do I care? No, actually, I don't, because there's nothing you can do about it, really. Um... We get a little bit low on cash. We could do with selling some stuff. But the thing is, we're building up our stocks of sunflower oil. We've got like 30. Um, if we sell that, that'll bring us in 300, which gets us back up to like 600 odd. So I'm not worried about that. Um, so we make the leather, and then we're going to want to make the leather into shoes. Now the question is, do I put our shoemaker like over here near the tannery? Or do I actually put him in the town? It's a good question. Let's have a look. Let's have a look at the building. Let's make let's let's make the decision based on the building. It's not a very big building, so we could absolutely put it in in the middle of town. Um, we just got something built. What got built? Don't know. Oh, the the slaughterhouse got built. All right. I don't know. Maybe I could. I guess I could kind of tuck that behind there. And I'd, like I said, a little complex of building. Go. Oh, I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. I think. Um, I can. Like, oh, there we go. That's lined up kind of nicely. So what I might do is put him... Uh, what I'm thinking of doing is being able to get a well in there might be kind of nice. Um, how much room would I have? I think I've got room for a well in there. So if I pop that there, please let me get a well in. Please, please let me get a well. Yeah, we can fit a well in there. Flip you around a bit. Oh, come on, come on. There kind of just just kind of sort of yeah boom one well sweet so we've got a whole leather thing going on now that's nice and that of course is going to create some um, beef and leather and then the beef we can sell oh we've got a messenger for marifa sweet we can finally sell our sunflower oil how much sunflower oil have we got before we start let's um let's go and have a look in here we've got 30 in stock beautiful so where are we? Where are we? Marifa, sunflower oil. We'll sell you 20. Deal. And then we'll sell you 10. Deal. And you can see the deals coming up here. So 0 of 20 and 0 of 10. Go. Cha-ching. So that's going to bring us in like 300, which gets us back up to kind of 650, which is much more comfortable territory. And of course, with our expanded farming enterprise going on over here we're going to be making more sunflower oil uh, well growing more sunflower seeds which will then turn into more sunflower oil because we've only got one guy working at the at the oil workshop so we can hire another guy to be producing more sell more make more money awesome we've got a family that's out of money but like seriously it's it's not this just happens you get some people who are really poor and some people who like they're poor but look, they've got 80 wealth. They're freaking really rich. 67, 110. Now, why? Seriously, why is there such a massive disparity? And I don't know. It just happens. It just happens. And it kind of happens, like, kind of regardless of what you set this stuff at. Right? So, like, if I put the rents up uh, to, like, 50, right? It won't make any freaking difference. People will still pay their rents and whatever. I could put the basic wage up, and I don't think that would make any difference either. So, kind of is what it is. Some people get rich, some people don't. It's just the way it works. And they can go into debt, which was the poor family. Um, 
find somebody who's gone into debt. Yeah. Oh, they, they almost. They got no food. Family out of money. Family out of money. Let's see. But yeah, they, they can still go and buy food and stuff. This is the family that's out of food. But um, yeah, they can still go and buy food and stuff. So yeah, I don't know. It is what it is. Right. Um, let's go over here. We've got our farm. Got our stuff going on. We've got our manager. We've got a couple of workers. Is that a third one? Did I set the... Yeah, I set that right. Um, bum, 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 bum. Right. Let's go up here. We've got the tannery. We've got the slaughterhouse, but we're not going to be slaughtering anything just yet. How are we doing with our oxen? They're eight months and seven months. Now, I don't know at what point they become, like, fully grown. I'm assuming it's, like, one year old, but, I mean, I, I could be totally wrong. Uh, what I could do, if I turn these guys into oxes, so that's an ox, and that's an ox. Now, if I try and get a plough... Order a plough. It'll say, need two adult oxen. And we don't have them at the moment. Now, my carpenter, I'm not using my carpenter at the moment, so I could free him up. Let's free him up. Um, we're finishing off the shoemaker's workshop. Pause. And um, once that gets built, what am I going to do next? It's a very good question. What, um, what I was thinking of doing was moving this back into here but I am kind of thinking like what do I want to do in this area I don't know I tell you what I might do I might ex I might put the bridge in and get the forestry going on over here because we've got like freaking great massive forest over here which I want to clear anyway um, uh, and I'm not sure what to do there where, oh now where can I put some more housing in where am I going to put some more housing in that's because we're running out of space for houses. And I'm, I'm thinking, I can either extend my housing. Now, I could put some housing in behind here. I suppose. So, let's see. If I put some housing in behind here. Um, i flip this around this way. So, do I want to put a couple of... I'm gonna, I think I'm going to put a couple of houses in there. So, hold down the shift key. One there. And one there. So that's another couple of houses. Uh, where else can I put some houses in? Can't get one in there for sure. So yeah, we're going to have to start extending. But I kind of need to plan out what my next extension is going to be. I do want to get some, some houses over here for, for, for this farm. But I kind of need to plan out how that's gonna be so uh, oops so if I get my if I get my second cow shed up and running let's do this do that so let's get a cow shed put in here and I want it right up against the fence because I want the I don't want a path going behind I want the path going in front so let's have the cow shed uneven to oh come on no no don't oh now I can put it there But I can't put it there. Now I could put it there. So uh, I've got that in front of there. I could put it. I could put it. I'd much rather have it. You know what? What I can do if I put it over this side. Yeah, yeah, yeah I can get this done. If I put this over this side, there. Boom. So that's going in there. What I can do, now I put um, well and some hay barracks. We'll just have a little bit of extra room on this side. So I'm still going to put my well on this side. Which goes, I want to flip it around, don't I? Yeah. I'll flip my well around like that. Boom. And then, now so it deforms the terrain. It just pulls the terrain up a little bit to accommodate that. Then we want some uh, some more hay barracks. Uh, that's under trade and transport. Hay barracks. I don't know why it's under trade and transport because it's neither trade nor transport. Uh, I want to flip it around this way. And let's have one, two, three. Oh, I don't think I can get. 
one in the middle of those. So we'll just put, I don't know, mate, mate. If I put that close enough, I might squeeze another one in. Will I get another one in? No. No! You know what? If I demolish, 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 demolish. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to try and squeeze these in if I possibly can. Uh, what do I want? Train transport. Hey, barracks. Um, that, can, that can just come around as like a tiny, tiny bit. Ah. ah, that's better, I think. So if we have one. Come on. Two. And three. Please let me get the five in. It would be so nice. Four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go, see? And five. That's awesome. That is awesome. And we've got loads of hay stored up. We're going to have loads more hay stored up. Because we've already got, let's see. Oh, that's grass. This is this is drying. That's grass, that's grass, that's grass. But we can put in a couple more hay dryers down here, which would be nice. Where are we? Hay dryers. Uh, so we want one there and there. Should I put in, yeah, another one? Another one, you think? Yeah, go on. Another one. I think it's nice having that. I like the hydros. I think it's nice having those along the riverbank. I, yeah. I probably could squeeze. Yeah, I could, I could squeeze one in down there, but I'm not going. I'm just going to leave it as it is. Um, windmills is going to be the next thing. Um, because let's see, we're just going to have one more wheat field, aren't we? Um, with the three rotators, so we're going to have one more wheat field going all the time. Uh, no, we should. Well, I think we should, yeah, we'll just double up the workers and then we'll be fine. How much wheat have we? saving up at the moment we've got we've got 7.7 .7. so it seems like we're doing just about fine with the running the two mills so yeah once we get that up and running should be good now did this stuff oh you know what i didn't do i didn't activate the fields but that's okay i always forget to activate the fields one two three and four and five so they'll, they'll start up they'll start up next year we're in june Right, uh, that, let's see, that cow shed's getting built, we've got a well to get built, and then I need to put in more houses. Now, huh. now what else am I going to put over here? That's the question. I'm going to need a cart park, for damn sure. So I'm going to put a cart park, I guess. Am I going to put the cart park there? I think I probably am. So let's do, where are we? Cart park. Let's flip you uh, wrong way. Let's put our cart park. Now, do I put it there or maybe, I think maybe at this end looks better. Kind of there. Yeah, we'll put a cart park in. We'll order some carts. One, two, three, four. I've still got my carpenter, haven't I? I didn't reassign him. He's over there. Uh, oh, I did. Well, let's get, let's get a, a carpenter working. So, um, Got that. I'm, well, I'm, see, I'm thinking houses. I'm thinking, like, I can have a couple of houses or something. The, the only problem is they're going to have to go quite a ways to get their food. Because they've got to walk all the way into the markets in town. So, I'm kind of thinking, so, does that mean I'm going to have another kind of sort of town going on over here? I'm thinking maybe. But I've kind of got to decide what my layout's going to be. Right, I've got no building going on at the moment, so... Time to do something about that. Do I do? I, I'm going to do the bridge in the next episode. We'll have a, the next episode will be like a bridge too far. That'll be that'll be kind of cool. Um, I can definitely get like one house in there. And if I move this back, then I could get like I could get another house in there. I've got my shoemaker. I need to start need to start killing some animals. That's what it's going to be slaughterhouse action in the next in the next episode. Have I got my oxen? How old are my oxen? So look. My oxen are um, 11 months and 10 months. I know they still need to grow up a little bit. Man, where can I put some stuff? This this I want to move back. I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that now, I think. So let's see. I want forestry. Now, the only question is, like, I could put a full row of houses. Like, so one, one there, one there. And then maybe move this back even further. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. I'm going to move this back further than I was going to. So, 
Uh, I want to leave enough room for a bit of a road in front of the houses, so let's put it there. Boom, forestry goes in. Now I can undo that. So now we can now we can do some houses. So if we get a house there, um, let's bring it in a little bit, I guess. Um, I want to flip it around down it that way. That would be a good thing. So let's put a house in there. I don't think I'm going to have room to get now. There's no way I can put one in there. So let's put you in there. Boom. And that guy's going to go there. So, oh, that's not going to fit there. So what I'm going to have to do, I think, is if I, whoops, if I flip it around this way, And, but it, it, it kind of goes out of shape a bit. But I think that's because I haven't got it square. Yeah, I haven't got it square. If I, if I get it actually, whoops, if I get it actually square, will it do something nicer? Man. Not really. I think I'd have to put that house in, like, first down there. And if I can get that house to be square, like that one, facing that way, then maybe I can get that one to be square facing up there, or, or facing out here into the alleyway. That would work as well. So I'll have to wait until I demolish that. So that's just going to have to wait. Um, phew, man, where do I put some more houses? Uh, what else am I going to have over here? I've got my cow shed. I've got all that stuff. Um, granary. That's the other thing. Am I going to set up a granary over here? Or am I just going to let the stuff get taken over there? I should probably just let the stuff get taken over there. Uh, at least for now. I might leave the room. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna leave the room there. Now, how do I want my house set up over here? I think what we'll do. Uh, so I've got my gate out that way. Um, if I just and give you just a search. Oops, wrong way. Uh, like that. See so what I'm. Th oh man. I'm going to have to leave it gap. If I press the alt key so it doesn't snap. Oh, getting this getting this straight so that I leave a consistent gap up there, that's not going to be so easy. Um, if I put house there. Ah, should have held the shift key down. And if I put a house. Uh, now this one wants to face down here, doesn't it really? Uh, do I put them together? Maybe I put them together. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. So hold down the shift key as well. Yeah, so hold down the shift key and have one there and one there. And then I could have a, maybe another row up there. Yeah, yeah, let's get that going. So um, these guys are going to need a well nearby. There's that one there, which we'll probably do for now. Um, do I want to uh, do I turn this around and have another another row of houses going up there? I, I'll probably end up doing something like that, but I think we'll leave it like that for now. I'm going to have a bit of a planning session and see kind of like as the town expands, like how exactly am I going to do it? It's going to be quite kind of interesting because we've really, I mean, this area is kind of filled up. I mean, I could expand, expand a little bit in this direction, but I'm not sure how I want to do that really. Um, and I'm not sure what I want to do with this forest, whether I just want to get rid of this forest or um, or not. Um, that I'm going to schedule for demolition. So I'm going to get a couple of workers in there and then I'm going to tell these guys to go away and am I just going to demolish it or am I going to let them kind of empty it out first? I don't know. I'm probably going to leave it for now. Alrighty. So we've got We've got our crops out. We've got a, oh, we've got a messenger from Marifa. Oh, we're going to pause it there because the first thing we're going to do in the next episode is we're going to sell off. Um, I was going to say we're going to sell off our sunflower oil. We don't have any sunflower oil. Why don't we have any sunflower oil? Have we run out? Uh, sunflower oil. Uh, maybe, maybe we're low on sun. Yeah, we don't seem to have any sunflowers. Oh, man. We need to get some sunflower crops coming in so we can sell more. But we're doing okay. Money's okay. Um, food is fine. We've got plenty of stuff. 
We're harvesting uh, wheat, we've got potatoes. Um, I should probably get a bit more fish going. What are we, yeah, we've got, we've got four fish. So yeah, things are generally going pretty good. Um, come back for the next episode. It's gonna be slaughterhouses and, and all kinds of other stuff and the second farm up and running and another plow and all that kind of stuff and more houses and we'll see what happens then. All right guys, I'll catch you for the next one. I hope you enjoyed it. Peace out.